I've been having a recurring dream. In it, I am ten years old. The hot summer of 95, and the air is smelting. But I'm happy, and certain nothing bad will ever happen. There are sounds that can change everything. They divide life into before and after. For me, it's the sound of falling hard. To the ground. I think I stayed under that tree forever. Like a nightmare from which I never awoke. But today, I will awake and return to that day to fix everything. This is my chance. I've worked towards this for years, studying physics and quantum mechanics, robotics and artificial intelligence. And finally, my goal is in sight. Beginning final tests before launch. Movement functionality works fine. Great. Grabbing functionality also good. Throwing accuracy satisfactory. Could be better. It's better than before. Climbing functionality, excellent. That's enough, at least it should be. Hang time functionality, works fine. You, little one, have a very important job to do. I'm counting on you. Initiating time transfer. Time transfer complete. Successfully arrived in 1995. Local time, 10 a.m. We did it. Movement functionality is damaged. Need to find and reattach the missing wheels as soon as possible. Okay, we are ready to go. Our primary goal is to find and destroy the red car. No car, no accident. According to my data, it should be downstairs in the living room. Good morning, listeners. I'm your host, John Haber. Be sure to grab a soda and a bucket of ice. Look, here's the red car. Try to get to it.
Great. Now we need to destroy it. Um... Oh! Well, let's use the garbage disposal unit in the kitchen. That should rewrite Adam's future. Running the divergence analysis. Divergence is... 0 0.0145. That's hardly anything. That kind of impact is not sufficient to change the current timeline. Guess that's how the self-consistency principle works. The universe does like to resist change. <laughs> we'll need to go deeper. To prevent Adam's accident. Running the simulation now. Circumstances changed, but the turning point is still the same. We should keep trying. If we get to the basement, we should be able to shut down the electricity. Come on, I'll show you the way.
I know that tape. It's a recording of Adam's first baseball game. He was really proud of it, and really upset when it occasionally wouldn't play. That should do the trick. Now it'll be impossible to erase. I hope it will help Adam. Thank you.